In order to cut something out of this photo, the first thing that we need to do is come over to our layers palette and make a copy of the picture. So I'm going to click on this layer and drag it down to this little icon that looks like a sheet of paper being pulled off of a, another sheet of paper. And we're just going to drag it over top and it's going to make a copy. Now I want to get rid of the original, the one with the lock is the original, by throwing it in the trash. Now I can enter quick, mo or excuse me, quick mask mode and I like to set the hardness to somewhere between 80 and 90. I'm going to get a little bit bigger brush. And I'm just going to do the world's worst, quickest cutout <laughs> just to uh, demonstrate sort of the different steps. I don't want you to have to sit and wait for me to make the perfect cutout. So I'm just going to kind of. get it done. Okay. And this is spot. Oops. Uh, remember that you can use your eraser. I'm going to set it to 90 because that's what I had my paintbrush on when I was selecting what I wanted to cut out. So there we go. We'll just consider this good enough for now. Uh, in order to select this, click out of Quick Mask and you'll see these little uh, dots indicating what's been selected. Now on my computer it's set up to select uh, whatever has not been masked off with the red. If yours um, looks opposite to mine, if yours looks something like this where now everything that you've selected in red is selected in the moving uh, sort of line here, then you'll want to go to select inverse and it will select the background instead of the object. Now all I have to do is press delete and I have a clear background.